Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm really excited about this knife uh, from Giant Mouse because I have been a fan of the Giant Mouse knives. This is the first one that I've actually got to handle and I really like it a lot. I, I hope you guys do too. Uh, this is from their Ace line, which uh, the Ace line for the uh, Giant Mouse and here's their logo, this is the box. Uh, it's basically their all-around EDC collection, and this knife definitely fits into that uh, definition of an all-around EDC knife. And this is the Giant Mouse Ace Corta, or uh, just the Corta. Uh, it's really quite a nice, well-thought-out, well-designed knife. I mean, this is, this is the stuff we live for, right? I mean, having something that's uh, really nice. As you can see, they've sculpted down, you know, where the uh, knife is on on both sides. Really, the uh, fit and finish on this is just excellent. Here's your uh, blade centering. And you can see if it looks offset, it's because here's your liner lock up here. So it may not look perfectly centered from stem to stern. But just a lot of really cool uh, features with this knife. We're looking at some uh, green canvas micarta scales. It has this beautiful brass uh, backspacer, which this is something that I haven't seen on any any knives. You see there's a little bit of jimping uh, to give you a little bit of, of uh, you know grip uh, when you're holding on to it. But I haven't seen anybody do a all brass uh, backspacer. So it's kind of a cool and unique thing. It'll have a really nice uh, patina over time. And that's definitely uh, something that, you know, you can look forward to with uh, owning this one. You have a nice little uh, lanyard slot there if you uh, prefer having a lanyard on your knife. And you see it has this uh, wire clip, which I'm a real big fan of the wire clips. I really like them. And it is uh, reversible, as you can see. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at our blade. It has a uh, flipper for deployment. And it has a really great uh, all-around blade shape. I mean, this is uh, your nice little drop point going to quite a uh, uh, pointy, uh, stabby-looking uh, point there, but a whole lot of belly. Uh, this gives you a full four-finger grip. They do put some uh, jimping that's a little forward of where I would place my thumb on a knife like this. So this actually is, is ahead of where... I would uh, have my thumb. But really for day-to-day uh, -day use, I found this to be a very comfortable knife and one that I really liked. Uh, the uh, blade steel here, we're looking at some, uh, it's a 3.1 inch blade, and that's from the tip all the way down here to the uh, frame. Uh, you're looking at some Bowler M390 steel, uh, they're micro clean stainless steel, and it does have a stone wash finish. Uh, it is running on ball bearings and it has a liner lock. Here's a picture of the uh, lockup on that. The action is, uh, is pretty nice on this. It's not as droppy as some of the other ones. We'll give it the drop test and my finger kind of got in the way. As you can see, as soon as it disengages, there's not a lot of uh, you know, room there. So it's going to come down the flipper is, but then it will uh, shake shut. It is, uh, like I said, a very handy knife. Uh, what we're looking at is the uh, handle is uh, 4.1 inches closed. You have a 7.3 inch overall length, and we're looking at 3.8 ounces for the entire thing. Uh, this is made for uh, Giant Mouse by Re8 Knives. And there is a link in the description uh, below that will take you uh, directly to uh, the Giant Mouse website. And so if you want to check out even more about this knife and about Giant Mouse, there will be a link in the, uh, in the description for you. Uh, I think this is just an awesome, awesome blade. Uh, I really liked it. The handle and stuff is very compact but it feels really good in hand, you know, so it, it's not, uh, I don't know, this is just a good, good working knife. Definitely one that uh, would uh, fit the needs of anything that you got going on.
that's for sure. Just a really good EDC blade, like exactly what the uh, Ace line is about. So that's all I have for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Please do use the link below to go visit uh, Giant Mouse and see what they got going on. Tell them I sent you and uh, just uh, enjoy your day. I will see you guys in the next one. I'll talk to you later.